here's what we got today on the Lunt 35 millimeter that I have bought this back in 2014 the lens cap is a rubber material and it, to me it doesn't offer much in the way of front impact because you can see it's it's soft I mean obviously you can't drop the thing but that was my concern so recently <clears throat> I've got a 40 on order and so I thought I would see if I couldn't find a cap that might be a little bit better to replace the rubber ones that come with the lunts. Now to do this, as you would imagine, you want a good accurate size on the diameter of the housing that holds the talons. You want the outside diameter here that I'm showing. Now to achieve that, I use my Mitsutoya 2 to 3 inch micrometers. Now if you're not aware of it, micrometers have hardened uh, faces on them. So the, the face there on this side and on the other side, they're hardened. So I didn't want to scratch the front surface here. Now that was very easy to accomplish. Here's what I did. I took masking tape. And I'll just put it on the top here for this example. But I took masking tape and on the two sides, which you see here up here, the masking tape, I put some here and here. So now when I took my micrometers and miked across the side, what I was actually miking across was the masking tape. So that way I would not scratch the surfaces then what I did is I took the two pieces together we'll just fold this miked that thickness and subtracted it when that was all said and done I came up with 61 and a half millimeters as the OD of that housing if we go to a Gina Astro's website we see the following cap Now we'll go down here to the specs, which matches up to a diagram of the various uh, diameters and um, dimensions that you might need. And you see that this is the one that will work. States that the imprint inside the cap will, will say 62 millimeters. And the price is only $350 a piece. Very, very reasonable. Now here is that dust cap. You can see that it does have 62 imprinted on the inside of it. And it does have these little ridges that you can see here. There. Along the perimeter of the outside that will act as grips and this is made out of a, a little harder material uh, like a plastic but it's more rigid so instead of being flexible like this as you can see it's rigid so it doesn't push in whereas the original cap pushes in and I just being so close to that front element I just didn't like that let's see how that fits just like that and you can see much more rigid to take it off it is on there pretty decent so what I do is I just hold the cell right like that and just pull it right off Now I did speak to Faye and I asked her about the being that this is the 35 I've got a 40 on order I assumed that the diameters would be the same and she did in fact say that the uh, 40 and the 35 are the same so if you wanted to replace your cap 
you could do that with this exact same uh, type that I did.